Hi. Two days ago, I came down with a little bit of an illness. I was bedridden. I spent the entire day sweating in bed. And then the next day, I woke up still not feeling good. I took DayQuil and I proceeded to go to a orthodontist's office whom I shadowed for half the day, feeling as high as a kite. I literally did not feel good at all whatsoever. Came home, destroyed my room, and then now it's today, and my room is destroyed, and I leave for a three-week trip in roughly six hours. We have to clean my entire room and pack for my trip and pack, and pack everything, everything and clean everything, everything and, get and get everything organized, organized within six hours, somehow. Let me show you my room right now, though. It's just a mess. I just need to start packing. So come on, let's pack together and get my life back together again. I am constantly just trying to get my life to feel it. Packing to be a European girl, girly. I am literally not in the mood to be going anywhere right now. My ears will not stop popping. Like, it's insane. They just keep popping. They won't stop, ever. I cried a little bit. Now we're back. I have such low blood sugar, I can't really do much, so I'm making myself food. I undid my bed, I unmade it, and now I'm just gonna kind of finish cleaning, and then once it's time to actually pack, I will show you what I pack. So just wait a little bit, please. Thank you. I'm like winded from my room. Is not super duper clean right now but y'all we did our best for now i'm doing laundry right now so hopefully once that's done i can like finalize cleaning my room but i'm gonna start picking out some of my outfits i have half of a suitcase to work with i really want to kind of style my skirt my favorite skirt my black skirt and i'm just gonna bring some clothes that i can kind of switch out with that and some shorts and this white skirt i want to bring really badly this is just one of my favorite skirts and i never wear it because it is very long and very kind of like mature so this was an outfit i came up with last night when i was about to go to sleep this skirt orange tube top it's just really cute and i feel like it would pair really well i also have this skirt i'm gonna be sticking to a capsule wardrobe type of thing because i don't want to bring too much i made a little pinterest board for myself of different Pinteresty items that I liked. So let's go take a look at that. I'm going for a very almost boho, not really, but like just like a cute European girl vibe. This is like I'm pulling this off so easily. Like I'm just here and I'm vibing, you know? This outfit, I love. I love her. Can you see it? I'll put it on the screen. A white blouse, denim shorts, and then a kind of it looks kind of like a cardigan. Like I could wear like like a little shirt over it. This is kind of like the thing she has. Mine is a little bit different. This is super cute just to kind of wear like that and then some denim shorts underneath I'm just gonna plan out like five or four outfits because I'm gonna go shopping there a lot And I want to bring some of like my basic essentials So like my shorts and my skirt that I love just to kind of mix and match because when I do go shopping I'll probably bring a lot back shopping is so much better in Europe Like the clothes are better like the style because people love to dress up there like in America people don't be dressing up I always find way more stuff super cute. I love Pull and Bear. I love Berkshire. I love Shredder VDRS. I think that's how you pronounce it. Just like all of the cute little shops out there. I want like a pullover. I was thinking this, but I feel like this is almost too structured for that. I don't know. I feel like this is too structured. Like this looks too much like literally structured and this is like flowier and boho and cute and loose. So it just doesn't go together. This. I love this. This is one of my favorite things and I bought it at Poland Bear. This actually might go together absolutely perfectly and I will scream. This is gonna be the cutest thing ever, I bet. I have owned this thing for like two years. That is so cute. <gasps> obsessed with that no way that is gonna be the first outfit i'm wearing that is so cute so we have kind of two outfits done guys let me know where you're going this summer where are you guys traveling to i've just been saving like a ton of long skirts tube tops cardigans like that's just the vibe i'm feeling like i want another tube top outfit i have a white tube top i feel like that's so boring let's keep looking on pinterest pinterest is the biggest help ever 
I'm feeling like I should just put a bunch of recent things that I've purchased into a pile, analyze it, and then see what I would want to wear with like my basic. Oh, you know what? I have a bunch of shirts I could wear. This top, very basic, very cute, but it goes good with my shorts. Definitely, I feel like I should wear this. This is totally like a cute little girly vibe, right? So let's work with this now. These shorts, light wash shorts, this cute little black top, and then fashion plug, you sent me shoes again. They're such good quality. I have the link in my description and a little coupon code for y'all, but I almost want to wear these to the airport just because they're comfortable and I like to wear sneakers to the airport. I'm just that type of goyle. And I also feel like the easiest way to make an outfit is shoes. I could literally bring like one shirt and then two pairs of pants. And then if I just wore like a different pair of sneakers every day, that would actually just make entire outfits. They sent me these ones too. They're blue. These red ones, university reds. I was dying for these. Like I really want to wear them with my red hoodie. I could actually wear these to the airport. Literally, this would go with everything that I've made out so far. That's so funny. I got these ones too. These ones are awesome. They're so basic. Two outfits done or kind of three, four-ish if I have that one too. And then I'm going to bring my black skirt and I guess I'll just bring a couple of extra tops. I also low-key want to bring this sweater that I just thrifted. It's a Harley Davidson sweater and I just love the design of it. And I just think if it's a little bit cold one day, like this might be nice to have. I could pair it with the shorts or with my black skirt most likely. So I'm going to bring this with. There was a time where I was not traveling because of COVID and just in general like we weren't traveling a lot and I feel like I've gotten a lot better since we started traveling more with like learning what to pack because I used to overpack and I would like bring way too much stuff and then I wouldn't wear it all. Plus my closet has gotten like a lot better like I am wearing more of the things that I own because I've kind of made like interchangeable closet. I know what I like to wear. I have this halter top that I could wear with something cute. I wish I bought this in blue because I feel like this is like so basic and boring, but it's still really cute. I also have this one, which is a little one shoulder moment. I love a good basic top that has some sort of like intricate styling to it, if you know what I mean. I have this, which to me is like more of a little nighttime moment, but I could definitely wear this with like my halter. But I don't know. I feel like like it's too silky. I need more long skirts. I'm definitely going to be on the hunt for like a long, cute skirt to wear. I have this black one too which would this go better with this what do you guys think black skirt or white skirt i'm feeling the black skirt i think it's lighter too is this ugly or this dress is a little bit you know stinky because i wore it the other day so <laughs> i could also wear black halter top and some shorts okay another cute outfit it seems like the theme right now is kind of light knit crochet should i wear something else with this not this tube top i just don't know if this tube top is giving like euro girl this is really cute i just have no idea what to wear with it like this striped skirt i bought forever ago this is giving okay this could also match so i guess we're not doing anything with the black skirt or should we still you know what? I wore this on vacation already another time I went on vacation. So this I'm bringing just like randomly because I like it. So it's not really an outfit, but it's something there. I'm going to bring another top like this. Just a random shirt to wear with shorts. Nothing too special. Three for sure outfits I have. Let's put those there. I feel like that should be fine. And then I'm going to bring a couple of these like random really thin t-shirts that I could just throw over whatever. And I might bring a couple of tank tops too. I just got a couple of bathing suits in the mail. So I'm going to bring them with just two the striped one I think I'm gonna bring and then this other striped one so let's throw those in the pile I'm gonna bring a bunch of random shirts with because that's the next easiest thing to pack I'm looking at this top I feel like it's really cute and flowy so we might wear this with my black skirt one day I'm gonna bring my two favorite tops right now this white one and this blue one we should probably start putting stuff in the suitcase so then I have less of a mess <music> I'm sweating so bad, like I'm overheating. My computer has not been working recently and I'm really worried that I'm gonna have to bring it over to Apple and be like, guys, what's going on? Cause she'll turn off and won't turn on. My next task, I'm going to be putting a ton of movies onto an SD card so I can watch on the plane. Guys, I ended up downloading a bunch of episodes of that 70s show cause I'm still trying to finish that. I've been trying to finish that for two years now. <laughs> like now I think it's time to pack my carry-on. I have the best carry-on ever from Target. It's 
it's huge. It's like this almost suitcase type of thing. It's just really great. So I'm bringing these two books. I just got these at Target. The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo. I heard this is an amazing book and I'm so excited to read it and it sounds really good. So I bought it because I was like, I feel like I just have to buy this book. Like everyone talks about it. I got Atomic Habits. The reason I bought this was because I want to make notes in it. So I want to draw in it and make notes in it, get a good understanding of it. That means I got to bring coloring things. I got these cutie little highlighters from Primark in Chicago and I'm gonna put those in there. And then a couple of fine tip pens. I'm gonna bring some post-it notes. I'm gonna put my laptop in here. I like to be prepared, so I bring these little nubs that go on my computer charger. I think my regular charger just broke. I found my Kindle and I found this super cute purse. I bought this at Goodwill two days ago and I was like, do I really want this purse? And then I bought it. And I'm obsessed with it. Like, I love it. I've literally have yet to find a purse that I like. Purse like this, like one of these that just go over the shoulder. I'm obsessed with this one. Like, I just love the color of it. And it looks good with all my outfits. Do I bring my dark brown ones or my light brown ones? Because I've been wearing my light brown ones a lot because I couldn't find my dark brown ones. We're bringing some sweatpants, an oversized shirt to go on top, just in case I get a little bit of, you know, like restricted. Cause I'm gonna wear a crop hoodie just to have a little keep fit, a little keep airplane fit. But eventually I might change. So let's go get that too. I'm gonna put my switch in here too. So there, now I have my switch, my shirt. Like I have everything practically. I have to shower soon. I am showering before I get on this flight. No way I'm getting on a plane feeling dirty and sweaty. It's so easy to think bright on the times from long ago That's all I know Hindsight tends to make things glow Forget all of it, forget all of it, forget all of it Look ahead to find an end and as they work all day We slowly kicks Vacuumed and I cleaned a little bit more off camera because your girl did not want to. Actually, my camera died. Finally finished putting everything away. My room is clean. I made my bed and I just feel so good. Like I just know that I'm gonna shower right now. I'm gonna change and I'm just gonna sit around and be on my phone for a little bit and then I'll leave. And then I'll have the time of my life visiting all my cousins that I haven't seen in forever. And then I'm gonna come home to a clean room and I'm gonna feel really, really good. Clean room, clean, clean, clean sheets. sheets. I'm literally like drenched in a layer of sweat. I love you guys so much. I have got to shower and finish whatever else. Let me know where you're traveling this summer. I'd love to know. Peace out. I'll catch you on the flip side in my next YouTube video. Love you. Love you. Love you. Love you. Love you.